Alrighty, so guess what we got in today? We got in our Double Masters VIP Edition. I didn't go big on these because, I mean, there's been a lot of controversy and I'm kind of glad I didn't. They're actually facing a class action lawsuit possibly over this. But nevertheless, let's just open this up. The, the four little boxes that we got right here. And just generally see what we get. Cause you know, you never know. Might get some good stuff. I mean, I, I didn't pay a bad price for it. Uh, I think I paid like three fifty maybe for all of them. Not bad in my eyes. Not bad at all. Especially just you know, other people. Some stores are selling them for just an overpriced amount, in my opinion. The only thing I don't like that everyone's mentioned is this little glue thing that, like, if you heat it up, you can reseal it pretty much, and that's just scary. So that's just a, a risk. Get the dual intake. There's nothing else in here. All right, here's what, here's what we got. To start up the pack. I was surprised the little box it came into. We got a mer. Oh, oh mercy. Anyway, fuck you. Back to me. Just kidding. All right, let's see what we got. Now I got a little bit of misprint there. I oh, can't see it, but like right here's those white dots. I don't think there's like anything super huge in the common slots. Ooh, expedition map. I really like that card. It's very underrated. Very good commander. Okay, so there we got our Cummins. Now let's get our Uncummins. Mm, there's some decent Fatal Puffs. I mean, Push. Go love that Fatal Push. Ooh, got that. That's pretty decent. Okay, here is our first rare. Let's look at this. Um, Deep Glow Skate. Um, got the Greater Good. Got Noble Hierarch. Not bad. Not bad. Mm, I'll take that any day. Um, just is really good. Um, good ramp card. Oh, Mama! Look at that muscly metal man. Oh, Karn, you're such a stud muffin. Just look at that Karn. Liberated. Kind of looks like he's um in a weird position. And we got our lands for us. I really like these. I can't. <laughs> it's pretty bad. These are the whole reason I bought them. To be honest, I'm just gonna put these up here. Corner. The main reason I bought them was because of uh, the lands. I know that's a bad thing. It's like, oh, you could have bought them online, and you know, just save some money. Um, but you know, it's about it's about the journey. It's about the journey. Whether I'm doing a bad journey, it doesn't matter. Still excited about that Karn card. I can't believe I got that. It's pretty cool. I'm genuinely curious because I haven't looked. I just really haven't really looked at a lot of the prices of this stuff. Um, I haven't been really thrilled to. Ooh, a little changeling. Changelings are decent depending on what you do with them. Divest, Whisper of the Wildies. Okay. Scar Ruin. Spurs of Mersmith. Rush of Knowledge. Pyre Wild. Heat Shimmer. Um, oh, well, our first mythic is Ensnaring Bridge. Um, Don't know how I feel about that. Creatures with power greater than the number of cards in your hand can't attack. I can see the use of that. Um, not sure the price on it, but we'll figure it out. Oh, thought twat my seas. That's just beautiful. Can't beat the thought twat. Just look at that nice art. It's beautiful. It's a very good card. Another noble hierarch. That's weird. But look at that noble high arc. It's pretty cool. Then got our lands. Man, these two is my last ones. And the tokens. It's pretty pretty nice. This is just gonna be a quick video and something just quick to put out.
feel like I haven't hit anything really big out of these. Like most people have. I know um, I've seen some people just open up boxes and they're just pulling like insane stuff out of these. But then I've seen people, you know, open a box and it's just you know not really been what you'd wish for. But I, mean, I think it's just interesting. It's nice having these like super foily cards and whatnot. But I'm taking these foils out and going put them aside. But you know, it's just personal opinion. It sifts all right. Set these down. Crushing dials. Real Smith actually kind of needed one of those. So that's that's plus. I like that thirst for knowledge art. Glad to get that. Okay, and now we got Kimba, Ka Regent. We'll figure out you know what her value and everything is eventually. Dark Confidant. That's pretty decent. That's nice. I won't complain about that. Um, it's kind of cool. Phyrexian Metamorph. Not the best thing we could get. But it's pretty cool to get that card. I really like the art. It's really beautiful. Then, oh, then we got the other Dark Confidant. That's kind of cool, I guess. And then, I haven't seen people pulling Dark Confidants as that new thing for me okay now let's open up our last one looks like it's been a quick video very very quick video These two tokens out the way. That's kind of cool. Cranial plating. That's a decent card. So we got master, masterwork of ingenuity. That's just meh. And we got Heartbeat of the Spring. Whenever a player taps a land for mana, that player adds one mana of any type that land produced. So, I mean, I guess that's just a double use. Not bad, especially in Commander. Explore my hole. That's nice. I'm glad to get that. That, that I'm really glad to get that. Can't, can't be an exploration. And then Kali of the Vast Penises. Um, it's good pool. Good art. Not bad. I'm okay with that. And then all our lands. All right, let's check, and I will see if I got my value really out of it. And I normally don't have been doing that. It's mainly just been for the opening, which I'm I'm okay with some of the pools I got. Um, but yeah, let's let's check on that. All right, so I definitely got my value out of it. I'm happy with that. So at least we made off. Um, thank you guys for tuning in, and see you on the next video.